Okay, second grade. Just like we always do, we are going to take just a few moments and we're going to reflect on our learning and how we um, are reflecting on ourselves and what information we have taken in this week um, and how we can connect it to prior, uh, previous weeks and prior weeks. So we can say, previously, we have learned about research. That was the last thing that we did. And so during time where we researched, what kinds of things did we do? Corey. We read information, didn't we? And what did we do with that information? We put it into our own. So we transferred that information into our own thoughts. Absolutely. What else did we do? Pardon? So we took in information, but not just through books. We took it in through the iPads, didn't we? Through technology. So we used different sources. We had articles, we had books, and we had technology. So that we know, oh, well, why do we do that? Why do we just... Why don't I just read a book and get the information just from that one book? Dominica. Because information. Absolutely. And it can also confirm information, can't it? Do you remember when we were reading the books and then sometimes on the biography the information was different? Yeah. Do you remember sometimes the dates could be different? So then we have to read a different source and just make sure and confirm which one was actually the right thing. Yeah. Okay, so those are the things that we were doing. How did we then continue that learning on to, into this week? What did we do this week? Sophie. We read Jack and the Beanstalk. What did we do when we read Jack and the Beanstalk? Yeah, we broke down the story and we put it into sequential order. Absolutely. And then we got a different point of view, didn't we? So we did a few things. When we read a book at any point, we read a book, we take details from the book, don't we? So when you're remembering or when you're recalling that book, you're taking details from the book and you're remembering them and in sequential order. Then we watch the video and we got the point of view of who? Who, Mia? The giant. the giant. Then you got the different point of view from the giant. So then what did you do? Kimberly. So you wrote. And who were you when you wrote? We were the giant. You were the giant. So you took that information and you then put it into the point of view of the giant. So when we can say the I can statement for this week, who can honestly say to me that you can now tell about a main idea and details after I listen to someone or read information? Who thinks that they can take information from books, from ones that you've read or that I have read to you? Who thinks that they can do that? And just on our rubric, can I, can I just see some numbers and just see how confident are you at doing that? Mm -hmm.